What's up guys, welcome back to some more Watch Dogs Legion. Yeah, let's get this started. How did everything go earlier? Fine. Might have found a suitable new candidate. Ready? Ready? Wish complete, let's go. So wait, some secret police fucker. Fast travel. I'm here. Are you ready to begin? Here's the gist. Malice Intelligence checks out. A rogue faction of SRS officers framed DedSec for the bombings to consolidate power over the government. But now they've noticed that some people are standing up to the new order, and they're blaming you. I believe these are the people you call Zero Day. I don't know their names, but it's safe to assume they have a ringleader. And in my experience overseas, removing the leader... I understand. Cut off the head and the snake dies. But are you here now? Two weeks ago, a shell company connected with Zero Day's operations imported 40 kilos of Semtex from an old Soviet bloc depot. But it never left London. Which means Zero Day is planning a bombing that will make those earlier bombings look like a bonfire. And I think I know why. As we're all now painfully aware, false flag attacks are a common propaganda tool for despots. Kill a load of people and the rest fall into line behind whoever says they won't let it happen again. In this case, Zero Day. Which means we both want to discover who's pulling Zero Day strings and stop them. We need to get hold of the personnel dossiers of anyone connected with the earlier bombings and their cover-up. Then Malak and I can analyze their common connections and work out who's in charge of Zero Day. And I'll be on the con to observe. Let's get it then. So if Malik's right, Zero Day are some kind of shadowy cabal of spies who blew up half the city to secretly take control of the government. But now they're pissed off that someone's standing up to them, so they're going to do it again. That's awful. I agree. You'd think they'd come up with something besides another bombing. Bit of a double beat, isn't it? Sabine, do you think Zero Day is doing this because of us? Because we fought back? Cut that victim flaming shit. I'd rather get blown up a thousand times than lie down just so some wannabe tyrants can stamp on my face. I can just see your rehearsers. Get a car, let's get a car. When we got the hack, I said. Let's get it, guys. Let's get it. Almost there. Let's go in here. We're gonna get in there. Where? 
I am here. You're stealing Sir's personnel dossiers. The organization is strictly compartmentalized, so they aren't stored in one central location. So we spy on the spies. Clever. What is the plan? SIRS uses a supercomputer called Filament to process information drawn from the CTOS network. It's like Noodle, if you could use it to search every document on every civilian, government, or commercial device everywhere in the United Kingdom. Instantly. Fuck! You could be horrified if you want, but it saved thousands of lives. Get access to a Filament terminal and I'll provide you with the search terms. I think you have to go here though. What are you getting here though? What I get in here, dude? Yeah. <coughs> okay, how would I get up here, though? Let's get up here. What stairs are there? You should like not, uh... I can't you like not, uh... what it is, I know it was it.
Let's hack into this thing, boy. So this is filament. Impressive. I can help you break in, but we're going to leave a trail. Unless, of course, Malik has an idea. There. I persuaded Filament Security to log that Spiderbot's activity as system maintenance. For a SAS agent, you're being quite open with us. It's not like the movies. Spies aren't the police. I believe in working with the lesser evils like DeadSec to protect society from the greater ones. So why did Zero Day kill all my friends? There are differing schools of thought. Rotate that one, rotate that one, open this one, rotate that. Dossiers acquired. Leaving mission area. Brilliant. They can't be far. Find them. Let's get out of here. I have the personnel files. Right, so we do a simple CTOS contact analysis and work out who's in charge of Zero Day. I'll have it done before you can say Guantanamo. I'll hand up the classified data, thank you very much. It would be so much faster if I worked with you in order to do this. The people in these dossiers are connected, but not necessarily complicit. It will take intelligence expertise to separate the wheat from the chaff. And when I discover something actionable, I will contact you. He's disconnected. Pleasant fella. Mrs. Dodd, honey trap. I have Malik for you. Connect him. We have to meet. There's been a complication. I can't access the files you stole. Excuse me? The files are locked, and a moment after we got them, I received this. <laughs> Hello, Richard. We see you're trying to find us by looking into our associates. That's a good idea. Hope you don't mind if we borrow it. Who was your masked savior, we wonder? I've sent Bagley the coordinates for a meeting. I hope I don't need to explain why this is a priority. Let's get in, let's go. Means meet Malak at the Cleopatra Needle cutthroat model. I found a potential recruit for you. Drop in a pin on your map. <sighs> Ooh, dumb.
place has changed since the bombing. All right, act like you're patrolling. Act like you're patrolling. Don't get up. I need a high-ranking SIRS officer's biometrics, eyes and fingers. No, no, you're wasting our time with this bullshit. Keep your voice down. The data was encrypted. So what? Bagley can brute force. Not faster than I could, and I've tried. It's hopeless in the time we have. Look, if you don't help me, zero day wins, which means we all die. Fuck. So you will need the whole finger and one eyeball? No. High-res photos will do. The problem is it has to be the acting Home Office liaison. And sirs will burn their credentials if they're attacked. It's protocol. So you'll have to get them the old-fashioned way. Ah, torture. Christ, no. Develop a relationship. Get someone close and uh, take the photos covertly. Okay. Could be fun. This part of the craft can be ugly. Send someone who can handle it. Okay. Bagley, can you help? I suggest you begin your relationship with the SIRS Home Office liaison the way you would with anyone, by meticulously poring over every detail of their life and hunting them down. Go on. The SIRS Home Office Liaison is the bridge between the government and its intelligence service. Their office at Downing Street would be a good place to start your relationship. That's our move, then. Let's get there and then switch. I'm gonna switch to somebody, uh, a different girl. A different swap with her. Oh, hey, 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 this girl feeling fit for duty today fuck yeah let's get up to some shit <laughs> oh what the Complete. Now scarper or they'll kill you for sure. 
Easy. Got it. 16 email threads indicate the Home Office liaison is a right lush. She spends most of her time down at the Three Hawker Boys. If you want to seduce, sorry, start a relationship with her, that's as good a place as any. Give me the location. Done. Now seems like it's been around forever, but it's really quite a new invention. Were you an early adopter? I was one of the first that was in this market. There seems to be a new way of financial transactions, a new way of money, it's something that we could completely reinvent and change some of the legacy financial systems. Uh, we drive here, we drive here, we drive. Control, I've lost the target. Fall back. Over. Oh, my God. Okay, he said you still need us. Okay guys, I'm gonna end here for this one. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace!